Trilogy Evo is compatible with a range of accessories, including a roll stand, detachable battery, air inlet foam filter, USB connection, and wheelchair mount. For optimal performance, use only accessories intended for use with this device, such as the roll stand. The detachable battery can provide up to seven and a half hours of therapy, and when combined with the internal battery, can increase to 15 hours. To remove the detachable battery, open the access door, then lift the battery handle and gently pull it out of the battery bay. To view the percentage charge, press the button on the battery. To replace the battery, slide it into the bay until it clicks into place. The battery will charge automatically when connected to AC power. Whether stationary or mobile, protect Trilogy Evo from dirt and dust with a disposable air inlet foam filter. To remove the air inlet foam filter, pinch and pull. To insert, place the filter into the filter cover and position it securely behind the top and bottom restraints. Trilogy Evo offers several connection options for displaying and transferring data. First, we'll review the data display accessories. SPO2 and Entitle CO2. Insert the appropriate cable into the USB on either the patient or utility panels. You can see the SPO2 measurement in the monitored parameters pane and the pulse rate information in standby and various monitoring views. To check Entitle CO2 levels, insert the USB end of the cable into Trilogy Evo and attach the appropriate airway adapter on the other end. The adapters are available in adult pediatric and infant sizes. The recommended procedure is to calibrate the airway adapter prior to use. To do this, go to the Options menu, tap Calibration Setup, then CO2 Sensor Adapter 0, and follow the on-screen prompts. It may take up to two minutes for the end tidal CO2 data to display when it is first connected to the ventilator. After calibration, attach the airway adapter to the end of the patient circuit. The USB port is also used with a USB stick for data downloads and software updates. This is accessible via options and then data transfer. For patient mobility, the device can be easily and securely attached to a wheelchair using the same attachment plate as the roll stand. These and other accessories make Trilogy Evo versatile and convenient for clinical use. Philips. Trilogy Evo has been designed with an easy-to-use touchscreen interface. In this video, we're going to demonstrate window navigation and some important functions including info help, battery information, monitoring views, and changing prescriptions. While in standby on the home window, you can view the entered prescriptions on the left-hand side. On the bottom right of the window, find Start Ventilation. The New Patient option is in the top right section. Next to the Home window is Settings, where you can enter Prescription and Alarm Settings. For more clarification on a setting while entering a prescription, press the question mark icon for Help. To close Help, press the X. Options, which contains Preferences and other choices, is next. You can change the menu access level between Full and Limited. Transfer for USB data downloads and software upgrades. Information provides device details such as current software. Calibration Setup contains O2 and CO2 sensor calibrations, among others. Below that option is Alarm and Event Log. In Prescription Preferences, you can delete or edit the prescription names and background images. displays an 
prescription, be sure to have a circuit in place. Press Home, Daytime Prescription, and then tap Start Ventilation. If the circuit becomes disconnected during ventilation, you will see high priority indicators. In this instance, connect the circuit to resolve the alarm condition. To learn more about the alarm, tap the alarm list. Since the alarm has resolved, you can tap the alarm reset icon. There is also an alarm silence button to mute audible alarms for two minutes. A variety of monitoring views are available. Some offer more details than others depending on whether you are in full or limited access. Select Limited and tap the check mark. Then return to the home window. To go to temporary full access, press and hold the digital clock and then the alarm silence button and keep holding them together for five seconds. A confirmation pop up window will appear. Follow the instructions. Taking the time to become familiar with Trilogy Evo's functions can help you deliver quality, efficient clinical care and enhance patient comfort. Philips. Trilogy Evo ventilators deliver enhanced performance in both non-invasive and invasive ventilation. There are four types of circuits that are available. to the active exhalation valve on the circuit. The active flow 
limb circuit is now complete. The dual limb circuit has a blue inspiratory limb, a clear or white expiratory limb, two bacterial filters, a proximal pressure line, flow sensor with cable, and dual limb active exhalation valve, referred to as the AEV. Connect the bacterial filter and blue colored limb to the inspiratory port. Then attach the proximal pressure line to the proximal pressure port. Now insert the dual limb AEV into the exhalation valve connection until both sides click into place. Then attach the bacterial filter end of the clear or white limb into the AEV. Attach the flow sensor cable into the connector. Next, attach the appropriate flow sensor, adult, pediatric, or infant, to the cable and clip shut. To complete the circuit, attach the flow sensor to the Y-shaped connector. The dual limb circuit is now complete. Philips. Let's go through the easy setup of a new patient on Trilogy Evo. Begin by turning on the device. From the home window, tap New Patient. This clears all pre-existing patient data. Choose your preferred prescription name from the table and tap Accept. Read and acknowledge the statement. If the appropriate patient circuit is attached and you want to ventilate with the pre-programmed settings, you can begin therapy by selecting Start Ventilation. If you need to edit the prescription before initiating ventilation, tap the Settings icon. In the Settings window, you can view and edit all the prescription and alarm settings. Thank you. 